guys. Oh, guys. You know what I hate? I hate BS venues. This is one of those venues that I will never come back to ever again. Top 10, no, top two. The worst load in I've ever had. First of all, I know what you're saying. Well, John, that's why you tell us to do our site surveys. So you don't run into any uh, weird situations. You're 100% correct. I don't wanna hear it, okay? I'm the professional. I should have done a site survey. You're right, and I didn't. So it's my own fault. But anyway, dude, this place, out in the middle of nowhere, luckily it's only like 15 minutes from my shop, but again, out in the middle of nowhere, um, place called, I don't even wanna name the name because I don't want them finding this on the internet, but let's just say it's, uh, it's built with matches and hay little barn style wedding that a lot of them are here in Arkansas they haven't done the proper they haven't laid the proper foundation to make their place a success case in point it rained for hours last night they don't have like proper drainage so they're standing mud standing water we're an hour and a half away from ceremony time and the, the bride's dress is muddy that's I would not be happy take care of your place but anyway, so I didn't come out here to do a site survey. My own fault. I get it. So what? Uh, but now I got to go back to my shop because their ceremony location is a good 100 yards away from the reception location. And there's no power out there. Absolutely none. Um, so I, you know me. You saw the jump box video. I bring 150 feet worth of extension cable. This wasn't enough. But John, you should have done your site survey. I know. And I'm not doing another site survey out here again because I ain't coming. Pro tip. You work for yourself. If you don't want to go to a place, don't. Screw them. If you can't tell, I'm kind of pissed. I had a meeting with my CPA this morning. Oh my gosh. The amount of money that I owe the IRS. Taxes suck. So if I seem a little short today, Uncle Sam, I hate you. strike on this so Trey right now mute the music okay we're back ceremony's over now we're doing the reception it's very uneventful um, I hate this venue I'm ready to go home
Hey guys. All right, so we are back in the office gig. It was good, it just lasted, I think it lasted a little too long. Now, we were there for like six hours total, and that's a, I mean, that's a long time. That's a long time for a gig, um, especially when we started. We actually opened the dance floor an hour and a half in. So we played almost five hours of, uh, of dance hits, um, and wow, it just, it was a lot, it was a lot. So, um, right now, we're actually going live on the internet. Um, all in all, I give that gig a solid, we'll give it a solid 3.8 out of 5. 1.2. 1.2? Really, Trey? I didn't know. Trey was ready to go home. Like, instantly ready to go home. Not every gig is a home run, and that one certainly was not. Uh, the load-in totally sucked. Totally sucked. Um... Just not very conducive for vendors. Uh, and like I said, you know, I probably um, should have done a site survey. I didn't, and I paid for it. Even though I was going to do the gig anyway, I would have known what I was getting myself into. And even not that even it was that bad, but just there was no paved surfaces, so the cart didn't work out. Um, the ceremony area just was way too far away from the reception area blah 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 i feel like you guys are gonna say it's my fault and it actually was so uh so yeah a lot of drunk people but you know it made it kind of easier uh kind of easier on me i wouldn't say um uh, everybody knows that alcohol makes a party especially a wedding um so it's hard to do them without it but uh had there not been any alcohol tonight oh would have been an extremely long night. We probably would have got out of there in a couple hours. So, right now you are, this is the first vlog of Vlogmas. The first episode of Vlogmas was the live stream, which was yesterday. Um, today is the first day of Vlogmas. So, in the live stream yesterday, I explained all about the giveaway, all about Vlogmas, all that stuff. Um, so we're just gonna like jump right into um, like we're gonna have a lot of content coming up here within the next month up until Christmas I'm vlogging every day until Christmas so if you haven't already subscribe I need you to subscribe we need 5,000 subscribers before the end of the year for the giveaway um, so stay tuned for that hit the notification bell so you can know when the new video drops every day from now until Christmas also if you got any questions feel free to email me right here djwoopig at gmail.com i do respond to your emails um anybody that's emailed me you know good and well that i respond to your emails the one thing that i do not want you to do is call me don't call me okay i've said it enough and you're gonna hear it 25 more times social media stuff you already know that uh, be sure to follow Trey's uh, new Instagram, Trey Turn, uh, to see behind the scenes stuff. Follow Trey Turn, follow me on uh, so social media. My main source of social media is Instagram, so that's where you shall find me. Um, but yeah, no stupid long outro. We'll see you tomorrow.